Last year, after especially after losing all those guys, like you knew you needed to step up, have a bigger, you have a bigger opportunity, a lot more expectation. So I just like try to take it in stride and try and do it as well as I could. You never really have a day off, maybe once a week, and so it's every time you have a day off, you're always like doing work. Every time you're like. After practice, you're doing work, but it really helps when you have guys on the team like Justin McPherson's in my class, Luke Richardson's in my class, so we just, I don't know, I don't want to say we work together, but we work together and uh, we get it done. Well, it's huge because especially even after pro hockey, there's a lot of, like, there's a lot of years to live after, so you need something to do after, and school is pretty big. So like being an older guy on the team, there's a lot of new young guys and just always being encouraging to them on the ice during games like because you can see sometimes their confidence gets down or sometimes they get like a little frustrated in what's happening but it's all part of the process and you just have to let them know it's okay. Well obviously like everyone in my family, like my dad was huge for me growing up. He still tries to coach me like uh, but uh, honestly, I'd say my brother, he, uh, he was the reason I got into hockey and he was like, he's always been pushing me, like we've always been competing against each other, so he's helped me like improve my game and improve like all aspects of life. You gotta be consistent, you gotta give the work, put the work in every day if you wanna make it and just keep on chasing your dream.